pull the cord and dive a needle. The race is about to unfold as they go now to the fence that will bring them to the bottom of the hill. This is the fourth last and it's still Native Robin enjoying the conditions from Mixed Lad up there on his flanks now in second as they take it. So Native Robin, Mixed Lad, a bit skew with in third was Maxo, then Namako. The pink colours of Dive and Needle goes up into a share of third and ridden then in last of six has pulled the cord. So they begin the turn to the third last and it is Native Robin at the bottom of the hill leading by a length and a half to Mixed Lad. Maxo Namako gets shuffled along and then pull of the cord and die of the needle. So not an awful lot covering these six runners still only about four lengths first to last as they come over the third last and Max Lad is the one our mixed lad is coming up there on the outside now to put it up to Native Robin. They've quickened on from Dive of the Needle, who's going into the third position. But now the favourite, mixed lad, and Harley Dunn takes it up on the approach to the second last. So at the second last, and it's mixed lad going on now from Native Robin, then Dive of the Needle coming through now into second. And they're going away from the remainder, but it's Harley Dunn aboard. Mixed lad comes to the final fence, and he pops it nice and neatly. Dive of the Needle runs on through into second and then pull the cord. But as smooth as silk, David Wynn. In here for Mick Goff's runner. That's Mixed Lad in the hands of Harley Dunn wins by a comfortable three. Nice run in second from Die of an Eagle and then pull the cord will have learned from the experience in third. They were followed home by the longtime pace setter, Native Robin Namako, and last of six finishes was Maxo.